Weather is a big deal and it impacts nearly every part of our lives and it can really affect farmers. Absolutely. And with a recent hailstorm destroying entire crops, we sent Liam Healy out to Wayne County to see what else might have been impacted this year before the apples begin to get picked. Well, most of us only think of apple season really starting to pick up just about now and heading through the fall. For people like Jamie Sonneville, the vice president and co-owner of Lakeville Orchards here in Williamson, it's an all-year event. The amount of labor that goes into raising fresh fruit is crazy. We we do, um, you're tying trees, you're hand pruning, you're hand thinning to make sure you have the right amount of apples per branch um, so that they get nice and big, they're not too heavy, they don't overload the trees. And so far this season, the weather outside of an early frost has cooperated up until recent. The weather this summer with the rain, the heat, it's actually been a great season. And we've had the last week or so relatively cool evenings, which helps the apples turn red. So the weather's been fantastic until last week when we had a hailstorm. That storm this past Sunday devastated for some their entire crop. I mean, the hailstorm that we had was unreal. It was, I think, five minutes or so. It'll come through and it will damage every leaf, which means now each leaf is susceptible to airborne pathogens. And it'll penetrate the skin of an apple. And when it penetrates the skin of an apple, it sets it up to decay within days. And what most orchards in Wayne County are wholesalers like Lakeville Orchards, where you can't go up and pick the apples yourself. When it comes to your everyday shopping, you can still support them. I think the most important takeaway from any ag industry is to buy local. It is really important when you go into a supermarket and you look at what's on the shelves that you think about where that was produced and who that is impacting in your local community. Now, despite some challenges this season, like every season faces, there is still plenty of fruit available. And again, the most important thing that you can do is just buy local. Reporting from Williamson, Liam Healy, News 8.